and Americans, they are voting on Senate and House races. We want to go first to Governor Jim Justin speaking right now. West Virginia. West Virginia to have a GOP majority in the U.S. Senate. Well, it'd mean a lot. That's all there is to it, because let's just take take one thing at a time. we got to have an energy strategy in America. That's all there is to it. They want rid of us. Do you realize that if we don't have a majority in the Senate, they want rid of us as far as coal miners, gas workers, whatever it may be. Literally, we can't possibly. It is so frivolous, it's unbelievable to think that we can do without fossil fuels today. I'm the guy that's all-encompassing. You know, all the alternatives I've embraced. But with all that being said, it's decades away, decades and decades away before we can do without fossil fuels. If then, why blow our own legs off and hand our legs to China and India? I don't get it. And as a, as a freshman senator, I mean, how do you get in there? How do you get the committee assignments you want? How do you sort of work to, to establish well, yourself? Well, I've, I've told them. I've told them a bunch of times, you know, where my expertise is is finance and energy. And at the end of the day, if they don't want to use my expertise there, well, they just they just make another decision. But I, I would promise you that before the day's over, they'll listen to me. They'll really listen because I got a lot of knowledge in both those areas. You're one of 100. What does your one? All right, that was Senate the Senate race. Jim Justice giving his acceptance speech. We want to go now to 